world will be watching this Sunday as the Denver Broncos take on the Seattle Seahawks in the biggest football game of the year, the Super Bowl. The team with the best defense faces off with that team with the best offense. If you want to score extra points at home, though, please welcome Chef Adrian Perez with HEB Cooking Connection. Hello. Oh, good. good. All right. Uh, you know, a lot of Super Bowl parties have turned into not just some chips and popcorn, but it's like an all-out feast. It's a new day. You got to have a great spread, and there's four essentials. Okay. Barbecue. Well, Chili, bacon, cheese. Oh, yeah, yeah. You say bacon and cheese, everything is good right there. Uh, speaking of, what I love about HEB, not only do you have the great food, and you have either cooking all the way from scratch or things that can get you halfway there, right. but you also have some of those utensils. This is from HEB. Love little... my George Foreman. Yes. I don't have a patio in a small apartment. This goes in the back room, open the window, doesn't smoke out the place. It's electric. You can clean it very easily. Love it. And you go to town. All I right. go to town. <laughs> get that bacon wrapped so, chicken. So, bacon up wrapped here. chicken's up first, y'all. It's going to be bacon jam glaze. And if you all haven't oh. heard of bacon jam at HEB, one of the coolest and neatest things coming out on the shelf. Uh, low calorie, actually. Made this stuff with is so good. Real bacon. I mean, not just good. Do we have to put some chicken and bacon on it? You can just eat it out of the jar. Like it is, right? You, no, this stuff is so good on everything. So, quick method on your bacon wrapping chicken. You've got your chicken tender, you've got your bacon strip. Here's a quick it's almost like a fire drill. Remember mm -hmm. these two things loop it, spiral it, tuck it. So, okay. <laughs> Loop it, drop and roll. spiral yeah. it, tuck it. Yeah, it works for plane crashes, all kinds yeah, of stuff. Right. Um, <laughs> so, double loop them, spiral it down the tender, wrap it in the thing, tuck it in, get your grill nice and yeah. hot. Because that way you don't have to stick the toothpick That's to it. That's right. You don't yeah. want to have the wood on there. No, you don't want that. Uh, Southwest Ancho, guys, from Adams Reserve. Really nice crusting rub for the grill. We're going to dust a little bit with that. It's going to cut through some of the sweetness on the bacon jam. Give it a couple of minutes on there. I've already got some wrapped up for you. When they're done, plate them up, ready to go. Take your bacon jam right over the top. Yeah. Ooh. Works That'll for everybody. Good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, and with that said, sometimes people over season stuff like this, like they'll put salt on it. If you have bacon on anything, you probably don't want to add any salt. What do you need it salt for? It. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. You don't want to get bacon too salty. Bacon jam goes on everything. Oh, All since right. Valentine's Day is coming up, uh, steaks, lobster, uh, fish, chicken, your significant other, it goes on everything. Just keep yeah. that in mind, okay? <laughs> Uh, moving I just pictured it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. no. Okay. You got to throw it in there. Yeah. Uh, moving right along, here are the facts Texas Cookwell and Company two step chili, gluten free, vegetarian approved, right out of the jar, clean, simple, no MSG. What you do is add the meat to the jar, gourmet chili in five minutes. Yeah, add but, meat if you want it. Yeah. Right, if you want to. If not, beans and vegetables do well if you're mm -hmm. vegetarian. I made a Southwest Super Bowl turkey chili for you guys today. So I typed the recipe during the freeze. Five minutes later, it's 80 degrees. Yeah. But we're going to roll with it anyway. So you've got your squash, your ground turkey. We can use beef or chili meat if you want to keep it old school, but we're doing turkey. You've got white and yellow corn, kidney beans, a little matchstick carrots. We're going to do some green zucchini in there for color, a little half moon style. There you go. Oh, we're rolling off the board here. That's all right. Uh, and then, guys, brown it for a couple of minutes. Get everything nice and golden. In goes the chili. Give it a stir. Serve it up. Cornbread on the side. It doesn't get any better than that. Yeah. All right. And, yeah, and that's a, that's and it's quick and easy. Uh, probably uh, the only thing quicker quicker and easier than that is when you open up the bag of Fritos and pour the chili right on this top of it. Yeah, this, this is true. This is true. But this, this is, is true. This is healthier. This is healthier. It's better. It's affordable. It feeds a lot of people. You can add broth to it if you want to feed about two to four more out of the jar. Okay. All right. Third coming up. This is the fastest one on the menu today. You've got some Korean style barbecue meatballs. So Fisherweiser has been a brand on the shelf for years. They're trusted. They come out with one. Wonderful things. They're I know. Hungry. It yeah. really, more credit you're giving me than I need there because this is so easy. So, fully cooked meatballs at HEB, mm -hmm. throw them in the nooker for like six to ten minutes, just thaw them out. You can brown them in the skillet so people think you made them from scratch. <laughs> Throw them over some rice, throw them in a slow cooker, you pour your sauce on top. Great Super Bowl food. The guys will eat that up. But of course, they're not going to leave it as neat looking as that. Yeah. So and easy and quick for kids, too. By the way, this is in my son's lunch today. Dig in there. Absolutely. <laughs> it really is. I made it this morning. All right. And then the last one, you can't have a good Super Bowl spread without a cheese dip. So mm -hmm. listen in closely. We're all health conscious just a bit more these days. So Cookwell Company, same guys that make the chili, have come out with this fat-free, gluten-free, gourmet quality queso. Seriously. Uh, 
Yeah, I'm not lying to you, really. Um, it does exist. And it's full flavored, so it doesn't taste like it's missing anything. Mm -hmm. So we're going to stretch it out today with not just beef, but I'm doing ground bison. It's the new beef. It's very, very lean. It cooks quickly. And it's, it, if you're afraid of gamey flavor or anything, it's simple. It just tastes like beef. So explore a little bit with the ground bison. So you've got your bison in here. You've got a little bit of canned tomatoes, the cheese itself. Now, what I'm going to do to feed a few more heads out of that jar is take a little bit of Greek yogurt. You can use full or fat free. It's Does that make it a little creamier? It makes it a little creamier. It's mm -hmm. a good stretcher and it also keeps it a little lower calorie and healthy for, healthy for you. And just a fresh diced avocado gives it some great texture, you guys. So, half your avocado here, grab your knife, keep the shell on. It's pretty impermeable, so you don't have to cut yourself there. Slice it right in the middle, go across. And out Oh, come. wait, okay, turn that around to the camera right there, there so you can see what you basically did. You basically cut that little grid pattern in absolutely. there. Absolutely. Still in there, and so that's easy. And then yes, you just. Yes, ma'am. And then just, you know, you can squeeze, squeeze it. it out, spoon it out, but you get these really cool chunks in there. I know. I thought about that all by myself. And really, there, I did. Look at David. There you go. <laughs> all right. Um, you talked about being more health conscious. It's interesting because a lot of the commercials during the Super Bowl actually are focusing on healthier things. So, yeah, a little, little trend that's going on here. Absolutely. And it's got to even showing up in those commercials there. That's Adrian, right. thank you very much. I'm coming no, to your house you for the game. Hey, I'll have you over yeah. anytime. Right. Hey, by the way, everyone in our studio audience is going home with Cookwell Company Texas Two Step Chili from ATV. <laughs> For more ideas for game day snacks, just log on to HEB.com or check out the Cooking Connection at your local HEB. There are actually chefs in the store, so if you have any questions about a recipe or what you should do, uh, you can just flag one of them down and they'll help you out. So maybe you're just not in the mood to throw your own Super Bowl party. That doesn't mean you have to miss out on the fun, though. You can still celebrate the big game at one of the many sports bars around H-Town. In fact, our correspondent Courtney Perna is getting an early start hanging out right now. Hi, Courtney. Deborah, they're putting me to work. We are setting up here for our tailgate party, so if you don't want to clean up after your friends at your house, just come to one of the sports bars, like you said. After the break, I'll show you where you need to go. Put it over there. And where it's all set up. You know, Emma likes it. She's checking out the block, right? <laughs>